Here in Aitu in northern Lebanon, rescue workers are searching for human remains. After a deadly Israeli strike on Monday killed at least 21 people, including women and children. The Christian majority town is the furthest north Israel has hit during this conflict, but it is Hezbollah that some residents blame. Hezbollah dragged Lebanon into war. This war has no end. Death only brings more death. What more can I say? On Tuesday, Hezbollah's acting leader delivered a statement laden with threats. Addressing the Israeli military, he said that the solution is a ceasefire, but that without it, the group will continue to fight and will inflict pain on Israel. Since the Israeli enemy targeted all of Lebanon, we have the right from a defensive position to target any point in the Israeli enemy's entity, whether in the center, the north or the south. And it was not an empty threat. In Israel's north, air raid sirens blared and rockets were intercepted above Haifa City, where meanwhile some 30 patients were still being treated in hospital after the Iran-backed group's attack on an army base on Sunday, which killed four soldiers. Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu did not immediately respond to the statement from Hezbollah's leader, but he has made it clear to date that Israel will continue to target the group mercilessly in, quote, all parts of Lebanon.